This record rainfall turning roads into rivers, some drivers trapped inside their cars by the torrential floods. And tonight, a lot of people across Chicago land are dealing with flooded basements. NBC 5's J.C. Navarrete shows us the treacherous conditions. What began as a gentle rain in the morning quickly turned to this. Flash flood warnings for the Chicago area, leaving drivers asking for help. Scenes like this seen all around town. A group coming together to push this van off the road. It wasn't just neighborhoods dealing with the floods. I-290 quickly overrun by the storm. Traffic dwindling down to just a lane. Just about everyone we spoke with was at a loss for words. Have you ever seen anything like this before? Never in Chicago. I mean, I'm from Dominican Republic. And over there, yes, yeah, the hurricane. But here, it's never happened before. Well, I'm worried now. The sheer force of the rain on full display behind me here on Kinsey and Pulaski. Take a look. Five cars submerged below that rail line overpass. One of the dozens of areas where we've seen drivers stranded. It's something like from a movie. I ain't never seen it like this in person. Like I see it on videos on Facebook, but I ain't never seen it like with my own eyes. Like I ain't know it was this possible it can be flooded like this. Zevelin Mendez caught up with our Telemundo partners to show the damage rain has already caused to her apartment. Rainwater up to her ankles now. Her boyfriend Alex is just trying to do the best he can, but he knows they can't do it alone. It's very heartbreaking. As a man, it's just what can I do? Because I'm doing, I'm trying to do the best thing I can to, you know, take the water out. But if there's no pumps, what else can you do? In the midst of the chaos, there were moments of hope where neighbors came out for one another. Neighbors like Ryan, armed with a snow shovel in one hand, looking to clear the drains in his neighborhood. This is it's good to be a blessing to everybody and stuff. Even throughout the whole city, it, it was a whole lot worse now. I kind of opened that up a little bit more and stuff. Yes, indeed. But I, I'm going to keep on doing what I'm going to do, just make sure everybody get through and stuff. JC Navarrete, NBC 5 News. He's a good guy, or thanks to JC.